Hello, Jess Too Good here, and oh my gosh, LEGO Shop has revealed the Spider-Man No Way Home sets releasing October 1st in the United States. Don't worry, these first two sets are based on Homecoming and Far From Home. The last one could be considered spoilers for the location if you are trying to avoid it. info on this movie by now. So yeah, there's going to be a Sanctum Sanctorum set with Doctor Strange, which I think, yeah, he was announced to be in the movie like a year ago, so it might not be considered a spoiler to most people. Uh, there's Wong in that set and Spider-Man. I love the new suit and the new Doctor Strange cape that's blowing my mind. It seems to go around just the neck. I want to see that on different minifigures and also a new updated MJ that looks so much better than that one from Far From Home. The $40 price is perfect. The build is a fun facade that's different enough from the last two Sanctums with lots of little knickknacks lying around. I even noticed that creature build at first. That's almost Mantis-like. <laughs> I love it. The drone duel is a $20 set based off of Spider-Man Homecoming. Well, in Inspired because yeah, remember the big golden drone from the movie? It's so strange. I would call it a great build, but interesting enough with its color scheme that I like it. I want it. The vulture design is brick built like the original 2017 set, but I love the helmet this time using an existing piece. The golden Spider-Man suit is another what the heck that I do like. And finally, Far From Home gets a set, the Spider-Man vs Mysterio drone attack. We got sets for this film back in 2019, but this is a 4 plus set. Everything is juniorized but adorable. I like the design of Mysterio's drone. While I would have liked a new Nick Fury, it's cool to get that version in a cheap set. But I do love that we're getting that red and black Spidey suit. And the Mysterio update looks pretty cool. Anyways, I can't wait for these sets on the figures alone. But my absolute favorite is the Sanctorum, since the build is that interesting play set with varied relics. And yeah, I know I keep saying the Sanctorum. This is the Sanctum Workshop, which is actually underneath the Sanctum. It's a basement. But anyways, what do you guys think of these sets? Let me know in the comments. And which is your favorite out of all three of the LEGO Marvel news revealed today? Also, subscribe for more LEGO Marvel content if that's your thing, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.